Hi, welcome to Fly Planet. And you know we have the question here. The there is a farmer which connects who connects a pipe of a internal internal diameter 20 centimeter from a canal into a cylindrical tank in her field, and which is 10 meter in diameter and 2 meter deep. Right. So that's the dimension of the cylindrical tank which is given here. Now it says if water flows through the pipe at the rate of 3 km per hour, in how much time will the tank be filled, right? Now what we are going to do here is that suppose, let's imagine, suppose that the tank is going to get filled, is going to get filled in m minutes right now we also understand that the volume of the water volume of the tank right the volume of the tank volume of the tank is equal to the volume of the water flows in m minutes right that's also there right so let's first find out the volume of the tank now that's equal to the pi r square h that's the formula which we already know for the case of cylindrical vessel now the diameter is 10 meters right that's the diameter of the cylinder so we can say that the radius of the of the cylinder that's going to be 10 over 2 and that's like 5 meter right so we can say pi 5 square right multiply times times h that means 2 meter so that's like 2 so this will come to 50 pi meter square that's the uh, volume of the uh, entire tank now this will get filled in m minutes now let us also calculate that volume of the water which flows in one minute let's calculate for one minute first right how much of water flows in flows in one meter so volume of water let's calculate first volume of the water flows in one minute right so that's what we need to calculate first so the internal diameter so the pipe is also uh, in the form of a cylinder right so the water which is coming in one minute is going to be uh, you know that's also we calculated with the help of pi r square h now here pi is this r is going to be 10 centimeter right now everything we are doing in meters so let's convert this also into meters and that's why that's why this is going to be 0 0.1 meter so multiply 0 0.1 meter whole square into h now this is 3 kilometer per hour right so it's coming like uh, you know let's do a small calculation here water flow the speed is 3 kilometer per hour or we can say 3000 meter per hour or we can also say 3000 over 60 meter per minute right so that's going to be like 50 meter 
per minute. So in a minute, the length of the water is 50 meters. So we will put 50 here, right? Now this is going to be <coughs> pi and 1 over 100 multiplied by 50, right? So this is going to be pi by 2. Now this is meter square. Now this is the water which is coming in one minute. So how much time will this much of water take, right? So that's a simple, you know, division situation now. So we will say that in one minute, oh, this is a cubic, I'm so sorry, this is all cubic because this is the volume we are talking about, right? So this is cubic meter. Okay, so in one minute, the volume of the water which flows flows is pi by two cubic meter right or okay so instead of this let's write it in this way and that will be very very simple then right so it's like pi by 2 water takes 1 minute right so 1 cubic meter this is pi by 2 cubic meter so 1 cubic meter water will take how much that will take 2 over pi minutes and therefore 50 pi cubic meter water will take 2 over pi right and yeah that will take 50 pi so pi gets sorry pi gets cancelled with pi and this is b this will be like 100 minutes right so that's the answer finally so 100 minutes is the time which will be required for this tank to get filled in when the farmer has connected a pipe with the internal diameter of 20 centimeter right so i hope you could understand this question the question was very simple and it's a matter of calculation that's all nothing else thank you so much have a nice day and bye bye